once you have set up your blog, it's going to take you um, to a page where you would be able to do your first post. However, we're not quite ready to do that yet. Um, before we do that, we need to customize this a little more. You'll notice at the top of your screen here, there are some tabs along this area. Um, we want to go th to the Design tab. And that's going to take us to a place that we can then basically customize the look of our blog. Um, each of these boxes is the basic area where that content is going to be. Here's your title, these are where your blog posts are going to appear, and then over here, depending on which template you chose, are some other, um, they call them gadgets. Okay. Uh, one of the requirements for your project, your blog project, is that you have a profile um, or an about me portion on your blog, and Blogger will automatically have that as one of the gadgets. But because this is the required element, let's bring this up to the top. So you want to click on that box. Notice how my mouse has turned into a four-headed arrow when I place my mouse over top of, you know, these objects. So I can click, hold my click, and just drag it to the top. Okay. If you click on this Add a Gadget, that's going to take you out to a page where there are a variety of gadgets that you can look through. You do not at this point need to go through this, nor should you. Um, this is something that you can look through once you've completed all the requirements and you've completely set up your blog and done your first post if you have some extra time. Um, these They give a brief description of each of the gadgets. Um, you know, remember that you do need to keep within the theme and idea of your blog, so you need to choose something that would um, be a court, you know, go along. So you would not want to choose Newsreel, which is going to pull in current event headlines when this blog is supposed to have taken place during World War II. So just be smart about it and do this kind of on your own time. Once you've moved the um, About Me section up to the top, you can go in and edit that section, and this is where you can actually fill out the profile portion of your blog. And once you've done that, you can hit Save. And you can always, as you're editing your blog, you can always hit Preview to see a basic, you know, what your blog is going to look like. Okay? So you can, my next post will be on how to do your first blog post.